Hey, Justin, we're all back again here with Flex MP, bringing another Movement Monday. Last week we showed you a little drill there on the box, but some people are unable to even get into that pigeon stretch. Here at Flex MP, we look at, like to look at things in a variety of ways. Um, if something's bothering somebody like back, knee, hip, ankle, you know, we don't just like foam roll it away or find that magical stretch. Um, we like to get to the deep seat of the issue if we can. If not, then we definitely send them to a, a qualified physical therapist. But this is a great one for releasing that glute if you're having any kind of back, knee, whatever issues. Anyways, I like this one from Mackie Mobility. We can grab any foam roller. You're gonna get it right up here in the upper part of the glute, the upper butt, uh, anyways, the glute med. Um, always be gentle, just kind of get a release here. Uh, get a nerve response going back and forth. Just watch out uh, for that hip joint. And I like this just because you can get a little along that edge there. From there, after I spend, you know, about 30 seconds or so, you're moving in different directions. I'm um, gonna do this elevated pigeon, but we're gonna do it a little bit differently. We're gonna rotate our hips, make sure they're squared out, and we're gonna bring this leg over to how much that heel is attached. And then we're gonna move in uh, through all three planes of motion. So we're gonna shift here to the side, keeping those hips squared. Then we're gonna sit down in it here, just like this, feeling that stretch. And then we're gonna go into that rotation. I'll do about five reps a side and do that twice, or maybe just send a minute on there. But to kind of make all this stick, so we released it, we loosened it up a little bit. Now we want to create some activation um, to start strengthening these muscles. So one way, there's a lot of different ways to do all this. We're going to just create a little bit of a hinge here. So we're going to loading up that glute, getting into that heel, and then we're just going to step in different directions. You can play around with this. Again, we want to make sure we're not rounding the back. So I'm still got my chest lifted, but I'm really leaning my weight into that butt here, into that glute. Whew. Oh, and as Glenn felt earlier, so really fire things up. And you can do this as prep work before a squat or a deadlift day. Some great stuff. Well, thanks for tuning in. Hope that helps. If you're still like, well, what do I do? Come out here. We're all about educating you and teaching you the right way, the better way to do things. Take care and tune in tomorrow for a nice TRX Tuesday.